Hey YouTube, thought I would do a unboxing video today. I don't typically do many of these, but this one I think is going to be worth it. Uh, and uh, I think you guys will all appreciate it, especially if you're into shrimp. So let's get to it and stay tuned. All right, so what I have here is three boxes from Flip Aquatics. My good buddy Rob Lupton, who runs Flip Aquatics, one of the largest or maybe the largest shrimp retailer in the U.S a real fast growing company that um, from what I can see is doing all the right things and uh, is really making an impact in the hobby. Also Rob makes a huge impact uh, with the YouTube community when he uh, works with these uh, YouTube fish tube booths at uh, Aquashella, Aquatic Experience, places like that. And I uh, thought I would uh, just do an unboxing of what I purchased from him. These were not sent to me for free. Um, I decided it was time to uh, get some shrimp for one of my tanks and I'll show you a little bit more about that in a minute. Well, we'll show you right now. The 90 gallon, um, I wanted to get a, a ton of shrimp. I've got a few other uh, sources that I'm working on getting shrimp from too, but I really wanted to just overload this tank with shrimp and uh, this is a good start right here. So. Let's go ahead and open the first box here. We're going to attempt to do this one-handed. Packing job looks phenomenal, as you can see. We've got fragile stickers and live animal stickers in multiple places on the box. So, let's try to do this with one hand. It's gonna be hard, but all right. I might have to set this aside for one second. Okay, sorry about that. Couldn't do it one-handed. So the first thing you see is good insulation, styrofoam insulation. Looks like either half or three-quarter inch thick. And then we've got ooh. We got some samples here, Brightwell Aquatic. Ooh, some of these new uh, Swedish fish, nice. Some of these new Brightwell Aquatic um, shrimp products. And we're gonna show you. We got some sh cherry shrimp and these are nice sized shrimp and just in looking through the bag and the fact that they got a little bit cold, you can tell that these are high quality, nicely colored shrimp. For cherry shrimp, something that you would consider low grade and not spending too much on, these are really well looked, looking as far as the color goes. So that's the first bag. Got the styro packing around it. This kind of styro, I'm not sure what that's actually called, but all seem to be alive and well. Again, well insulated box. Nice looking, healthy, good sized shrimp. Again, these are the cherry shrimp. The They're not a painted fire red grade. They're just a kind of a standard grade, or I don't know if you'd beg to call them low grade. I forget how he has them classified on his website, but they are very nice looking, and I couldn't be happier with what I'm seeing through the bag so far. We're gonna go ahead and open this second box here. All right, so we've got the second box. I'm just gonna kinda do something like this here to try to work better with one hand, but uh, three more bags, everything appears to be alive, color looks great. Man, these look awesome. 
All right, so I've got all three boxes unloaded here. Eight bags total, and basically I ordered 200 um, of, of Rob's cherry shrimp uh, from his website, flipaquatics.com. They're all gonna go in this 90 gallon planted, and I've got some shrimp in there already, but uh, we're gonna add a bunch more, and it's gonna look sweet. So I'm gonna go ahead and acclimate these, and then uh, we'll show you what they look like when they get into the tank as well. All right, YouTube, so I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do as far as drip acclimating goes with these shrimp. We're just gonna take and uh, put them all into this bucket right here. And as you can see, maybe you can't see, but I've got a uh, drip acclimator coming down from the tank. And uh, yeah, let's just go ahead and get it started. So what I do is I just usually take and cut these uh, bags open and let the shrimp all out. All right, so we've got all 200 of the shrimp into the bag, or into the, to the bucket, I should say. So you can take a look at that. I did notice one or two that seemed to be dead, but overall we had a super good survival rate. So that's always cool. And I just went ahead and started the uh, acclimation. So we'll just go ahead and uh, let these acclimate and then we'll put them in the tank. Okay, so the shrimp have been acclimated now for several hours. And what I'm gonna do is just net them and put them into the tank. So we're gonna try to do this again one-handed, but uh, let's uh, give it a shot and, and go here. Again, this is 200 red cherry shrimp. Okay. Didn't probably even get half of them there, but it's always fun to watch a bunch of shrimp get into a tank. There's some molts. A little bit of molting and shipping, I guess. Wow, I can see some buried shrimp and unfortunately a couple dead ones, but not a big deal. With that amount of shrimp, that's a, a minor, minor thing. Man, the size of these things is just really great too. Look at these. They're, they're really good quality as far as the redness goes. And again, these things have just been shipped and acclimated. So they are literally out in the elements, I don't know, three, four hours ago. And they'll color up even better. But, you know, some of them aren't, the, aren't as good as others. But that's expected with the grade that I purchased and it was gonna be a random scoop type of a situation. So they're really satisfied, really satisfied. All right, let's uh, go back down here. We'll go ahead and put these in. Get them all off the net. Ooh, drop a couple there. Again, super, super happy. All right, this will be the final net full and they should be all in the tank. Ooh, 
This is really going to add life to this tank as far as just a lot more action. All these cherry shrimps um, cruising around in the Monte Carlo is just going to be really cool. From what I can see, I lost two out of 200. So that's, and they're right there. So that's really good when you consider um, shipping 200 shrimp. So I've got them all in the tank. We'll go ahead and uh, end this video here, but I'll give you some updates in the upcoming weeks. All right, so thanks for watching this video. Again, I wanna just uh, make sure that everybody knows these shrimp came from Flip Aquatics. Um, I bought 200 of them from Rob. Make sure you go check out flipaquatics.com next time you wanna buy shrimp. Make sure that you check out Flip Aquatics' YouTube channel. Um, he puts out really good videos. Um, I've been following Rob and been friends with him on um, through YouTube. I don't know, um, I would say five to seven years now and more recently um, at uh, uh, Aquashella and then last year at Aquatic Experience, got a chance to meet him and hang out with him in person. Stand up quality guy. He's doing a ton for this community and doing a lot of big things. So make sure you check that out. If you're looking for shrimp food, shrimp products, um, planted tank products, fish food, go to my website, aquaticsupportsystems.com and check it out. Um, and if you're new to this channel, make sure that you subscribe. Until next video, we'll see you later.